on a record number of Californians. Nearly 20 million are registered to vote in the midterms, according to the Secretary of State's office. The big question now is how will they vote? This is the perfect person for this time and this era for the city of Oakland, and that's why I'm here supporting this mayor. Yeah. Recording artist and Oakland native MC Hammer brought the star power and his support to Oakland Mayor Libby Schaaf in her re-election bid. He's just one celebrity in a wave nationwide who are supporting candidates and urging people to vote. I encourage everyone, read up on the issues, come and express your voice and your vote this Tuesday. From rent control to repealing the state's gas tax and electing a new governor, voters have a lot on their plate. The line was out the door Sunday for early voting at San Francisco City Hall. Kyle Wayne brought his son. It was just easier given our work schedule to come out on a Sunday and come as a family and just vote. Inside, it was crowded with voters casting their ballots. The director of elections says early turnout has been good at 60 percent. We're trying to make the, make the, the, the uh, access to voting and, and, and getting ballots as easy as possible. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Ballot drop-off kiosks are set up outside City Hall. This is the first election um, of the Trump era. San Jose State political science professor Melinda Jackson predicts voter turnout will be high Tuesday, with younger voters making a big showing. Based on the data we're seeing so far, we do see a, a bump in voter registration among younger voters. We do think that we're going to see higher turnout among younger voters. Now, Professor Jackson expects turnout will be high for a midterm election, but it's a tight race. The big question, will President Trump rally his base and create momentum on Tuesday, or will the Democrats come out and vote for a change in the House and Senate? No doubt about it, enthusiasm seems to be high on both sides.